and they want Democrats to shut up? J.D. Vance. By the way, today uh, uh, it's been announced that today uh, Donald Trump is going to do his Celebrity Apprentice thing and announce his vice presidential candidate. And uh, J.D. Vance is at the top of everybody's list for probable. Uh, so, so J.D. Vance yesterday tweeted out, the central premise of the Biden campaign is that President Donald Trump is an authoritarian fascist who must be stopped at all costs. That rhetoric led directly to President Trump's att attempted assassination. P.S. I'm telling you, this kid who did this, who tried to, to, uh, tried to assassinate Trump, this guy who tried to kill Trump, was a school shooter. He was, he was the bullied loner who wanted to go out in a blaze of glory, and he was probably planning, uh, with his dad's AR-15, he was pl probably planning on shooting up the local school, and then Donald Trump showed up and he thought, hey, if I want to go out in a blaze of glory, this is a better opportunity. And by the way, why aren't Democrats right now introducing legislation called the Save President Trump Act to ban assault weapons? The kid was able to get off multiple shots very rapidly because he had an AR-15. Anyway, J.D. Vance says what he said. And in other words, Democrats quit calling Trump and the people who support him authoritarians or pointing out the parallels between their policies and rhetoric and that of the Nazis. You know, unless you want to be blamed for this 20-year-old madman who uh, fits the classic bullied loner profile of a school shooter wanting to die in a blaze of glory. And then uh, Tim Scott jumps in. He says, let's be clear. This was an assassination attempt aided and abetted by the radical left and corporate media increasingly calling, incessantly calling Trump a threat to democracy, fascists, or worse. Corporate media? Yeah, this morning, uh, Joe Scarborough got bumped off the air. A Republican! He got bumped off the air by MSNBC, apparently. Now, MSNBC hasn't made a formal announcement, but the, the, the scuttlebutt is that they were afraid that he might criticize Trump. It's like the cowing of the media has begun, and it, is, and it, it appears to be working.